Hello guys, today I'm happy to show you uh, the Easy Boolean Generator version 1.2 and this version came with some uh, improvements and I'm about to show you first of all is uh, now uh, the Boolean Generator is, uh, is an asset so you can always add it to your asset browser and you will see this icon here so you can drag and drop to your scene as I'm gonna show you right now drag and drop to your scene press ctrl z and then voila you have your easy Moolean generator I rename it I organize it better so now you have everything you need here okay and very much the changes are quite of uh, not that much but very important and that's what I'm I'm about to show you right now okay uh, we still have the blinds and we still have the interiors on off the interiors could off and everything else okay the one fixing that I've been doing is uh, that back in the days uh, the moulin was uh, being created uh, mostly from the flipped face so now it's fixed so you can see the the mullion is uh, kind of according to the the face okay the, the proper face as you can see here right um, and uh, those are the reorganized uh, layouts that I've been, I've been doing I've been working on okay and so basically right now you have uh, the frame one frame two glass and frame only uh, what do you why I separate them uh, like this because now you can turn them on and off as you want you can turn it off your glass okay or turn it off your second frame as you can see here as your second frame or leave it just one frame what does that mean? that means it's just a piece of a frame why is that important? because sometimes you just want to do things like that for example you just want to have one frame right? So totally adjustable, right? So for the purposes you want, and now you can basically do that, okay? And kind of keep going, right? If you want to do some more specific frame, that's that's the way to do okay so you have this option now right let's go back and to the settings okay the settings are still the same uh, frame one offset you can control frame one in and out you can control right how thick that will be okay the same thing from second to from frame two and for the glass you still have your glass adjustments right here okay let's bring it back to the full right here all right so uh, you have the, the settings here and uh, the thickness for the only frame is here so you can always like bring the frame to be as thick as you want okay and uh, the new the, the great new on this on this uh, release is that now you can always change the material of individual uh, frames okay so you have frame one that we can change to you know any material you want 
or you have in your scene and sometimes you have a frame here which is not glass it's just a spindle right so you can change the material and not using the spindle or you can use just mullions or any other material that you want right so you can even make this let's say like a door okay set up this and create a door right things like that you also can do so yeah that's pretty much it i hope you guys like this and like the control you have it here right it's uh, much better than before now you can do more things you can have more control uh, one thing that i would like to show you for example uh, why this is very useful let's say because maybe you have this guy here and uh, you want to have uh, two different uh, mullions here but you actually don't want to have this guy reproducing here because when back in the days if you just separate here you would have uh, the thickness of your mullion or of your frame one rep uh, reproduced here and that's maybe not what you want okay so in this particular case you may i will just copy here so you can see better the change what the change will be okay you may want to have this as a as a not as a as a frame not like this not connected so you can take these guys and these guys right and maybe separate one of them okay let's say this one make a second copy and separate that now you can take this guy and uh, and just delete this one so now you have this frames separately okay but now because you have the control you can for this guy for example just remove the glass and this one you can remove a second frame and take the first frame and reduce thickness of it even remove the second frame of this one take this guy okay and bring this guy something like this and this guy here here okay okay you see the difference now you have uh, two different uh, mullions in which you can control them uh, individually okay you can take this guy and move it out a bit do something like this okay so you have you see the difference back in the days it wasn't possible you you couldn't make it but now you can of course you still have to do a little bit of uh, studying and working and but now you have uh, this possibility if you wanna make panels look at this and here you wasn't really able to do that okay now you can because you can split it up them and having full control okay you can even take this one remove the glass and you have something totally different okay I hope you guys like it. Uh, if you like my channel, just subscribe. Sometimes I do some tutorials for people that are transitioning from Max to Blender, and sometimes just uh, tips for Blender. And if you want to check my other uh, generators, just take a look on the link in the description. And uh, there are very th interesting things uh, on the Blender market and Gumroad, and it's been always updated. And yeah. I hope you guys like it. See you soon. Bye-bye.